Our 2020 hidden camera investigation about a very common tool used to sell you cars on lots across America, the Carfax report. Perhaps you've seen the ads that Sly Fox on TV, 40 bucks, and you get the history of the car you're looking to buy. But is that the full history? Show me the Carfax. In the ads, that fox ready to bust any used car dealer who doesn't show you, the buyer, the Carfax. What do you guys got? Some kind of crystal ball? No, nope, she's got a Carfax. But we wanted to know, does the Carfax report really tell you everything about that used car you're buying? And what do the dealers tell you? 2020, putting it to the test. Right now you are recording. Our producers heading out with hidden cameras, shopping for used cars. At this dealership in New Jersey, we meet Rico, asking him to show us this 2011 Mazda CX-7 and this 2011 Hyundai Sonata. And it took just minutes before he turned to the Carfax to help seal the deal. I'm going to show you both of the Carfax. Okay. okay. In fact, listen in. Rico's sales pitch relies on the Carfax. Let me click on the Carfax. No accidents. One owner can't be that Carfax. The Carfax reports on both cars showing green checks, no accidents, no damage reported to Carfax. But what Rico and the dealership didn't know was that we would do our own research on those two cars. One of Carfax's competitors revealing that that Hyundai had actually been in a rear impact collision and that the Mazda was not only in an accident, but a multiple impact collision. The police report we obtained showing it was the car in the middle, hit in the front and the back, and we weren't about to be outfoxed. Hey, Rico, I'm David Muir with ABC News. We have a few questions about how you use the Carfax in selling your used cars. Okay. About to reveal the true history of that Mazda. But we have a police report right here which says the Mazda was in a major accident. Not only that, we contacted the former owner of the Mazda who told us he was in that accident and they were the middle car. I don't get under the hood of these cars or anything like that. If I print out a Carfax and if it's green, that means that the Carfax is 100%. That's not 100%. 99, 99, 100%. When that Carfax doesn't reveal that that car has been in fact in an accident, a major collision, do you not see something wrong there? You have to take that up with the Carfax. I mean, you got to take that up with the Fox himself. I mean, the Fox. The Fox, yeah. And so we did, heading straight to the headquarters of Carfax in Virginia. We showed them their clean Carfax report and then the police report on the Mazda. When an American family shows up on the car lot and says, show me the Carfax, are they getting a full and complete report on that car? They'll get the full and complete Carfax report on that car. Absolutely. Yeah, but that's not what I'm asking. I'm asking, are they getting the full picture on the history of that car. No, there, there is no full history on anything. And furthermore, Carfax says in every one of their reports, they suggest you get an inspection too, take it for a test drive. Service but we didn't hear that from the Fox in that TV ad. It says it on our website and it says it on every report that consumers are given. Does it say that in the ads? It does not say that in the ads. Do you think it should? You'll hear how he answers that question and much more should the ads be changed, plus an alert tonight about America's most troubled bridges and the dangerous debris on America's highways crashing into your windshield. The eye-opening report tonight on a special 2020 Highway Confidential. We hope you'll join us later tonight.